SR Natalie Bacourt, Synodality, The Process That Ecclesializes. Day 2 of the Asian Continental Assembly on Synodality began with an orientation provided by SR Natalie Bacourt, who praised the delegates for their ability to talk about tensions without tension. Moderating Saturday's proceedings for the Asian Continental Assembly on Synodality were Archbishop Anil Joseph Thomas Cattle of Delhi, India, Dr. Christina King, a member of the Commission on Methodology, and Momoko Nishimura, a member of the Discernment and Drafting Group. The orientation for the day's work was provided by S.R. Natalie Bacourt, Under Secretary for the General Secretariat for the Synod. She began by reiterating that synodality is a call of God. At this stage of the reception of the Second Vatican Council, she continued, Synodality has been discerned as the will of God for the Church of the Third Millennium. Synodality has already been defined in the Synod on Youth, she noted. One of the fruits gathered from listening to the young people and discerning, that took place during that synod, is the understanding that the only way to transmit the faith today, is to be a synodal church. Synodality presupposes transformation. Synodality requires kenosis, self-emptying, S.R. Natalie continued. It's really a path of conversion and transformation that asks us a lot of courage to speak, to listen with humility, she said. It requires attentiveness to the movement of the spirit of truth within. She also commended those participating in the Asian Continental Assembly, observing gratitude is also a necessary ingredient, S.R. Natalie explained. The more we can discern the gift of synodality we have already received, the more we will unfold the past for the future because synodality is a creative path. She compared the journey we are on as the journey the disciples understood in Matthew 14 when they had to cross the lake. It's an unknown side and at the time we can be afraid like the disciples. But crossing the lake will lead us to the heart of synodality which is to deepen our discernment of the signs of the times. S.R. Natalie concluded by recognizing that fear is naturally part of the process. The spiritual transformation synodality presupposes is an adventure because everywhere you have a call for change, a new way of being, we experience, some resistance of fears. The second full day of the Continental Assembly concluded with the Eucharistic celebration presided over by Cardinal Joseph Coops, Archbishop Emeritus of Karachi.